So we have our last one. I'll read it for you. The nickname is One Sided Friendship. Hi, Jamie. Super fan of yours. <laughs> My name is Annie. Um, Sorry if I did not pronounce that. And I would like to ask you what you would do if you were in my shoes. I've had one sided crush on this guy for almost five years now. Wow. I love him very much, but I don't really have any hopes of it turning into a relationship. T. Anyway, at the end of the last year, my friend asked me to help him out with his… With the recru- recruiting recruiting process for a huge law office here in Brazil. Because I'm a Portuguese and English teacher here. I helped him. Recently, I decided to reach out to him because I was going through a bad time in my life. And he and I used to trust each other a lot. But when I reached out for help, he, he didn't give a shit. That really hurt. Hmm. When he asked for my help, I literally stopped everything I was doing. In fact, I was in the middle of finishing my… Thesis. Thesis, sorry. No, no, it's fine. Thesis for university when I helped out. Not to mention, in the end, he got the job. I only just found out because I am really close to his mother and sister. And three of us were out together and they brought it up randomly in conversation. Our families are super close and his parents treat me like their daughter. Anyway, I'm so heartbroken that he didn't even care to tell me what he landed the freaking job. I wanted to confront about him about it. But I don't think it's going to make any difference. My heart is really aching right now. What will you do, Jamie? Thank you. Just like your uh, title says, one-sided relationship. That's just as far as it goes. It's a one-sided relationship. He treats he treats you like you're his little sister, and unfortunately, that's that's the reality of it. If he didn't, if he if he if you helped him get the job, but he didn't tell you he got the job, and you're going out with his mother and sister, and you're hearing it from them first, he thinks of you as family and it, it hurts to hear that. I, I'm, I'm sure it's not the answer you want. But if you're going out with his mom and sister and you're hearing it from them that he got the job and um, you brought your problems up to him and he didn't give a shit, give a shit then you're family to him. And that's just… It, that sucks. It sucks. It, it mm-hmm. sucks but… I mean, I think you know the answer more than us. You just gotta force yourself to think of him the same way he thinks of you. That's unless you wanna break it off. For me, I think it's always hurting um, because you like this person and you want more. And you kind of don't know that you want more, but inside of you, because you're interested in this person, like a different way of more than a friend, you want more reaction from him because you like that person. And usually when it comes to that person who likes someone more than the person likes you back, it's just shit. Whatever you do, whatever he does, you're not going to be like, okay, he gave me what I want. It's, it's not going to be that. So for me, if you want to tell him that how you feel about him, I'm not going to stop you. But if there is an answer in your head that you want to hear, and then if you're going to talk it out, I think I think it's not a good idea to do that. completely yeah. agree with you. Mm. Don't get the answer in your head. And want that from them. Because from advice. then on, you're going to get more stressed. The other people is going to be really putamsuro. Yeah. Like… And you might just completely ruin the relationship mm. forever. So. But even though if he thinks you as a family, he shouldn't have actually just… You know, like cut you off when you were in your bad times. But, yeah. but that's the reality. Like that's what he thinks about you. Even though you're in your bad terms, he's not there for you. So… I might not just put a lot of time thinking of a person who does not feel the same way as me. And find new friends. Yeah. Like she said, don't have the answer in your head first. Mm. Yeah. Girl, there's a lot of people outside who cares for you or can be there for you on your lowest and your status. So yeah. yeah. Give time to those people. But if you want to call them out, call them out as a friend. Not as somebody you have a crush thing. on. Yeah. yeah. If you want to be like, yo, you know, I helped… Like, Oh, but you didn't tell me that you got a job? Really? Yeah. Something like that. And I helped you out. Why didn't you tell me you got the job? And it's not cool. Mm. You know, I thought we were friends, you know. But don't put an answer in your head. Don't expect… um The answer. Yeah. yeah. Hi guys, it's your girl Jamie. Did you like this episode? I hope you did. And if you want to listen to the whole episode, go on to your podcast and download it and hear me out. And on this YouTube, please subscribe and plus this notification on. Because I want to see you on time. See you guys with WWJD.